my name is Siobhan Charles, and this is my story. Today, the 6th of April, on the farm with my husband. Not too long ago, I had a major surgery, so I was supposed to be on bed rest. But because I'm not going on to two, I'm already rest. I feel like a complete rest. So I decided to take a drive with my husband on the farm. While he looking off, tending the plants and so, we went for a little walk. So I asked him, can the car come this way? He said, yes, here is solid enough. So I'm sitting, waiting on him because I cannot fetch load or do anything heavy. So I'm supposed to be, you know, resting, waiting on him. I decided to take the car for a drive down the hill. So I'm driving and the drive was okay going down. I said, well, I'm going to park here and I'm going to walk the rest because the car cannot go any further because the other part where I wanted to really go down to the creek is very sandy and the car cannot drive there. So I said, I'm going to walk there, park the car and I walk slowly, went down, take a good look at the places along me. So I said, now I'm heading back up now. My husband called me, you know, you cannot go too far with the car. I said, I know, I park already, I'm walking. <laughs> when I returned, I said, no, I'm going to take the, like the, the Holy Spirit said to me, Siobhan, drive forward a little and then back in because there's not much space for you to re, um, turn around. So I said, okay, you know what? I'm going to drive in forward and then I can do this reverse. Mm -mm. I drive in. When I, <laughs> when I drove it, the car's like if it's stuck. I said, no, no, no. I jumped out the car. I went to see what was wrong. When I jumped out, did not put the car in park. The car started to drive down or jumping back, turn off the engine. No, put the car in park. And I get back into the car. I said, Lord, I need you right now. I need you right now to, for me to reverse and come up because I started thinking if this car stick here, I cannot push it because I just had surgery, a major surgery. My husband, it's only my husband and I, what is going to happen to us here on this farm? So I started to pray. I said, Jesus, please come down now and help me. I need you right now. I need you. I said, take the wheel. And I start to, and I get him back to the car. And I go back, reverse. And then I start to straighten up. And then the car stick again, stuck again. It was a sandy area. I said, Lord, help me, help me. I cannot stick here. I cannot stick here. <laughs> and then I went back in the car and I pressed hard on a drive and the car started to move it going. It's swaying and I'm driving. <laughs> I drive to the top. My heart was beating so fast because I'm just thinking if this car is stuck here, what is going to happen to us here? <laughs> so I said, only the Lord could help me. And guess what? It really do come true. <laughs> 